Okay, so it's the 22nd of July 2016. Just recording uh, the condition of this property. I'm um, at 47 Spring in Hucknall. And this is what we've got. So, top floor, bedroom. Uh, first of all, looking out over this, uh, out, out of this window over the first floor, uh, so ground floor, kitchen extension. There's quite a lot of bushes there that, um, they're interfering a little bit with the kitchen. We'll, we'll chop those back uh, and I'll be able to get a view of uh, that in a moment by going downstairs to the kitchen. But this is the, where the problem starts. This is the exterior wall and it's uh, sandstone, which was known. Quite in terrible condition. Um, let me see, it started to a little bit damp here and there. Actually, that's dry. I think that's uh, previous damp. That's not too bad at all. Pretty solid and stable. Looking out over this window again, I'm not sure if we can quite see. But, uh, if I open this window, we get an idea that through there we've got um, an, an, another piece of land, a patch of land which is higher. And we've just worked out that the, the level of that um, land comes to about there so just a, about a, a foot or so below that roof line which translates to about two foot lower than that so basically this here is above ground so to speak the other side and if we go downstairs we will reveal the issue and it's this so we've got uh, the earth floor behind it, probably down to about a, a foot or so higher than that. A sandstone wall that's got very crumbly. Obviously it's got lots of cracks. Firewall. It's had a lime render put on it in the past and that's that's come off as well. Salts there. All cracked. It was all... Um, Concealed by timber studwork, which was bowed. You can see it's bowed. This and that had this uh, plaster with wallpaper on it. Radiator was on it, and then this worst part is reflected there. And then inside of the stick, the lines on as well. We can see goes about quite a long way. Looks to be about. Two and a half foot before you get to the well, two two feet so you get to the other well, I'm in there so you get to the other one that, that wall there that like it's the other side of the wall. And then coming through into the kitchen. Again was all overboarded. That was straight and straight into level actually, if you look down there. But then underneath the walls deflected out at an angle from like that. And then goes up straight again and this looks like it looks like a garden wall because right at the top that's the last brick and that is the height of the uh the earth up, upstairs so all the way along there all the way along there so what we have to do is prop the wall up wherever we need to prop it up in here and more extensively in this room here it will be propped along here with acros, screwed to the floor, and then strong boys in, taking down a section at a time, rebuilding a section at a time, only a metre wide, the full height, starting in the corner where it's strongest, and going all the way across. That's the plan.